Now, there are strong rivalries that define every sport. In cricket, for example, it's England versus Australia. Then, of course, the trans-Tasmanian rivalry in Australia and New Zealand. And, of course, there's something about neighbours bringing out the best and the worst in you. Take the subcontinent rivalry. For the longest time, we spoke of India versus Pakistan. And to be fair, it's a rivalry that has stood its ground as well. But there's a new one that's sprung over the, last, over the course of the last one year. Bangladesh and Sri Lanka. And it's slowly turning into a bitter, feisty one. We witnessed that in the recent ODI and T20 series between the two countries. Both have been exchanging jibes and taunting each other. Sri Lanka started all, all off and Bangladesh was not one to bow down from a fight. Sri Lanka and Bangladesh. The one thing that brings the two nations on the same table is cricket. But the sport that brings them on the same table is also the reason behind their fierce rivalry. Bangladesh and Sri Lanka have played a lot of cricket with each other over the years. The numbers may favour Sri Lanka, but Bangladesh's rise in international cricket is bound to make this a more well-contested rivalry. And irrespective of the outcome, there have been several controversies surrounding their matches. You've got to remember Bangladesh's Nagin dance celebrations to Sri Lanka, mocking it when they were defeated. From Angelo Matthews's timed out dismissal to a mockery of it. Another chapter unfolded in one of the most entertaining rivalries. The feud between the two nations spiced up after the recently concluded ODI series. Bangladesh clinched a 2-1 win against Sri Lanka in the ODI series on March 18th. After the series win, the entire Bangladesh team came together to pose with the trophy. Bangladesh batter Mushfikar Rahim walked towards the team while holding a helmet. He was enacting as if there was something wrong with the helmet. Rahim was in fact trolling Matthews' timed out dismissal from the ODI World Cup in 2023. In the ODI World Cup match between Sri Lanka and Bangladesh, Matthews, who failed to take the field in the stipulated time period due to his faulty helmet strap, was dismissed, timed out. Bangladesh faced a lot of backlash for the incident. And ever since then, the two sides have tried to get back at each other with this matter. In fact, this dig at Sri Lanka was payback. Bangladesh getting back at what the Lankans had dished out in the T20 series between the two countries that had taken place prior to the ODI series. Sri Lanka had celebrated their 2-1 T20 series win by tapping on the watch while posing with the trophy. An act to taunt the tomfoolery they thought captain Shakib Al Hassan and his team had engaged in. The players were taking a direct dig at the much-talked-about incident from the World Cup. But Sri Lanka's assistant coach Navid Nawaz clarified on the matter. I think it was a celebration which was misunderstood at that time. It was during the heat of the game. Both teams should forget about it. They all give their 100%. Sometimes emotions come into the middle. The players are all very friendly outside the boundary line. They fight really hard once they are inside the ground. I think that's what the game is all about. As long as you maintain discipline in the middle and play really hard and then cross the boundary line and be good to each other, that's what both teams are expected to do. In fact, after the Sri Lankan players had mocked Bangladesh, Bangladesh captain Najmul Hussain Shanto had expressed his clear displeasure. There is nothing to handle aggressively when it comes to this. I think they are yet to move on from the timed out dismissal. They should move on and stay in the present, since we didn't do anything which was outside the rules of cricket. I think they are making a fuss of it, but we are not worried about it. That the same Shanto, who thought Sri Lanka was making a fuss of something that should have been brushed under the carpet, was all pumped up after Bangladesh's win in the ODI series and decided it was time to give back in equal measure. The entire team broke into laughter and collectively took a dig at the Sri Lankan team after the win. But given their history, more such chapters are bound to unfold. This rivalry flows deep, as it always is with neighbouring countries. With much in common, there's always more battles to fight. And the Test Series coming up can prove to be just as entertaining and caustic.